welcome or welcome back to my channel today as you can see from the title we're just going to be doing some things with the samsung galaxy z flip 4 i'm going to be showing you guys how to open pretty much any app on your cover screen and i'm going to be showing you guys a couple of cool features like you just saw in that little montage so to get cover os first you just have to go to the app store type in cover os this is gonna be my first time doing it too, so we'll see how it goes, but install. And then once you've installed that, you're gonna go ahead and open it. And then when you get to this screen, after you've installed the app, you're gonna wanna click this and pretty much look for Cover OS on there and then toggle that on. And then in accessibility, you're gonna go to installed apps, Cover Screen OS, and then turn it on and then this is for you giving them permission to look at your notifications pretty much just give them permission to whatever they want permission to some of you might not be comfortable with that it is what it is a lot of things you have to give permission to anyways if you have social media like they already have the information that they're trying to sell at this point so then you should be able to go over um and now it just pretty much is showing you the difference between your stock os so how your phone regularly is and cover OS in terms of the hand gestures and everything like that. So when you're swiping up, this is it on your regular OS and then this is it with cover screen OS. So once we're done with that, next, the more fun part, we're going to go over to the widget section and we're gonna be able to add a couple of widgets. You can only add three for free and then you have to pay um, to add a little bit more, but these are a bunch of the options. There's a couple, good amount. Um, I'm going to go ahead and do YouTube first. So you see it's been added right there and I'm just gonna add two more. Next, this is Chrome. This is where you get the Dino game. These are a couple of the other uh, options that you can do for Chrome but I'm just gonna add the dino game because I don't really need the whole browser on the little screen um, so we've added that I'm gonna do an Apple music one so add that and then you just scroll all the way back and they're all there make sure to toggle them on to delete them you would just click the trash bins of course and you can also move them around um, but yeah, let's see how everything looks now on the cover screen. For cover screen OS, you pretty much want to drag from the inner part and that will let you see all your little widgets and then unlock with fingerprint, tap the dyno and we can pretty much play on your phone cover screen. You don't need, oop, you don't need a laptop you don't need a computer to actually play the chrome dino game and then going back you just tap once and you have all your apps right there on the little screen the shape and like how your apps on here look honestly is really dependent on the theme that you already have on your phone so just keep that in mind there's no way to really customize these apps to look differently um but let's try let's see if we can play a game one of my uh games on here this is a boba making game oh this is a different one this is a farm game i thought that i clicked the boba one but anyway it's so cute it looks like it's working guys kind of hard to click and stuff but so cute you guys um
the YouTube one pretty much takes you straight to your search so you can kind of see the content I like just based on my past searches but um yeah you can pretty much just go ahead and you know watch stuff on YouTube on this tiny screen but yeah that's pretty much it with cover screen OS you have a couple of these so you can search but you see you have to pay for that sort in alphabetical order I guess everything up here you have to pay for them but I mean just having the ability to use all this stuff anyway is pretty good to me next we're gonna go over to phone and then you're gonna click three dots up here and then you're going to go to settings and then you're gonna go to flip options so now it says open phone to answer calls so now you can do that and close phone to end calls so I already had that one on and you can also put that one on so now if your phone's closed and someone's calling you you flip it up answers and then you also have the option to close your phone to end the call so the next one I'm very excited for we're going to open settings and then we're going to go to notifications this one is pretty much changing the notification style for your text so you're going to go to notifications then you're going to go to notification pop-up style then you're going to choose brief you're going to go to edge lighting style and then you have basic and that's pretty much how this comes up and this glowing line around these are the settings for that bubble ooh, glitter hearts that's really cute I'm definitely taking that one. Oh, the fireworks is kind of cool let's do hearts and then you can choose a color pink there's even a color wheel which is really cool oh my gosh I think I'm gonna do that one actually that's really cute and then you can do advanced you can change the transparency of this little border that's going around the width I think I want mine pretty big and the duration and here I'm just gonna give you guys a close-up like that feature um, but now we're about to go to our final tip so this one you're gonna go to settings and this one allows you to access your settings by just swiping down on your thumbprint sensor that is right over here so we go to settings and then we're gonna go to advanced features and then we're going to go to motions and gestures and then we're gonna go to finger sensor gesture. That's right there. And you can do toggle that on. And now you should be able to access your notifications just by sliding down. That is really helpful, you guys. I think this one and the text one, although they are not as big as the cover screen OS I feel like they're amazing features and I think these this is so cool even with my case still works perfectly fine which is amazing but you guys those were all the tips I had for you today I really hope that you enjoyed if you enjoyed please leave a comment like and subscribe I will see you guys in the next video bye